guys, welcome back to my channel. Another day, another video. So today we're going to do another reaction video. The most top five biggest Lego sets and destroying them. So come on, let's watch it. Why was he destroying that? 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 Why was he destroying that?
Uh, yeah. Uh, don't do that. Now, since the Millennium Falcon is meant to fly through the galaxy, what if a giant meteor from the sky came and hit it? So I built this very colorful ball in Lego. Okay, that actually held up surprisingly well. I'm honestly pretty impressed by the set, but I'm disappointed because it can't fly like in the movie. But I think I actually have a solution to making it work. Oh my gosh, let's freaking go. We got it. Oh my gosh, it's flying. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, stop, stop. What is... Oh my gosh, it's gonna break. Oh, you know what? I'm actually impressed this hasn't fallen. Okay, that was some good training, so now it's time for it to fly by itself. Bruh. Dang, what a piece of junk, bro. It's time to unbox and build our next Lego set. I searched the internet for the biggest Lego car I could find and found this one. It's a Lego Technic Ferrari Daytona SP3, and this one is made from 3,778 pieces. So now it's time for many painful hours of trying to put this together. And not only is Ferrari an expensive car brand, but this Lego set was also really expensive because it costed four hundred dollars whoever designed this needs a pay raise like look how complex okay. this thing is this car uses yeah, technic yeah. pieces which is a so lot bigger big. than normal lego that's but so much big. more durable and strong which means this car might actually be pretty hard to break and after 12 hours of building the ferrari was finished yes sir it comes with luxurious Yo. butterfly Yo. doors a working steering wheel no, and a lot I of other cool features like a working before. suspension system let's we'll see how bouncy it is yeah, yeah. Oh, oh crap, the back came off. So basically, this car is really complicated. Look how cool this is. The gears literally move the wheels. But like all cars, it needs to be able to handle some light crashes. So I built this testing dummy to add inside, and now we're going to put it to the test. Okay, test one. Ah! Holy crap, that was impressively bouncy. No. Now it's time to take this to another level, so I spent the next few hours building this massive ramp made from faceplates that goes down my staircase, and at the bottom is a yeah. Lego man living in his peaceful home that looks like something a five-year-old built. Okay, here we go. Okay, that ended up hitting my camera and not the house, so let's try that it again. Just hit the camera. What? what? That Ferrari literally bodied that house and made it fly through the air. And it, it looks like our dummy is still chilling in, in the there. Air. I set on my list cool. the Titanic. And I actually built it in a few videos back. And it's still put together chilling in my room. So we're going to do some tests with it. Like, can we get it to flow? Okay, here we go. Come on, flow. Yeah, it's spinning. Uh-oh. Now it's breaking apart. No, we can't. Well, at what least it's Titanic? movie accurate. But I already sunk this Titanic in an older video. So there's another test we're going to try. I want to see how it can hold up to a giant iceberg. Wow, that was surprisingly pretty durable. Oh yeah, I forgot, I left a mini thing in there. Now before we look at the world's biggest Lego set, here's a quick speed round of some of the world's tiniest Lego sets I found on the internet for only a few dollars each. This first one is made from 22 pieces and is a barbecue stand of a guy cooking up some bugs and chicken. This second one is made from 16 pieces and it's a farm guy that comes oh my with God, a dog and a farm. This third one comes with 19 it's pieces and it's a construction yeah. guy that comes with a working concrete mixer. This fourth yeah. one comes with 17 pieces and it's a British oh. soldier. Yeah. To use. Yeah, and this final well, set has 43 gun, pieces and it's a tiny it car that can fit one passenger bro. and it kind of looks like a smart car. Wow, that's a very fresh looking whip. And now, that's it is time for me to unbox game. the biggest Lego but set to exist. <laughs> this one costed $250 and goes by the name World Map. Yo, Lego needs to chill. Look how many studs this set has. Yep, that's right. Out of the 11,695 pieces that this set has... 10,737 of them are studs. And I'm about to do something that might hurt to watch because I'm going to combine all the colors together. It hurts okay, my eyes. Okay, though, that is pretty satisfying, not going to lie. Oh, this is so massaging. And I'm in this Lego set, they're massaging. supposed to act as pixels that's to massaging. a giant Lego image we're going to build. Okay, that's one down, 38 more to go. And this image is a massive map of the entire world. And I'm going to be honest, but this was the most robotic Lego set I've ever built. Like, my one job was literally to keep laying studs on a base plate. Okay, it's uh, 2 a.m., so I'm going to go to bed and finish this in the morning. So after a full day of very tedious building, our map was finally finished. Oh my gosh, it's the map! Yes. Looks like this one Yo, took me nine hours map. to build. The Yo, set comes with these tiny pins you can put on the map to mark where you've been. And it also comes with this very thick brick separator that can peel off seven Look studs in one them. go. You're actually Look supposed to hang this up like a picture on the wall, but that's something the NPCs do, so I'm going to destroy it like a cool person. I just realized that this earth is flat, so let's have to go to battle with my other Lego earth, which is round.
Wow, the round earth took hardly any damage. Okay, and it looks like the oh my gosh, the round earth won. I'm also a black belt in karate, so what if I tried headbutting it? And finally, what happens if I put it in the doorway and run straight through it? Yeah, so that pretty much broke it in half. Well, after destroying all these Lego sets, it looks like I'm gonna have to put these back together. Yeah, this was definitely one of the most painful videos I've ever done. Please give this video a like. I have an eight minute bonus gaming video for the new Lego 2K Drive game. So click the link in the description to see it. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you later. The video was awesome, but why would they destroy that whole cluster? That's actually the challenge. Oh, okay, now I get it. Now I will just keep it, and now I will just, I will just broke it. Now I will just, I will just get, I will just build something out of it. Just like when Dominic. Oh, good job. That's it for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed that. Like and subscribe if you like it. Bye for now.